one of you guys, one of the Gas Gang family, the opportunity to win my Audi RS5. Guys, take a look at this. So what's going on Gas Gang? Today we are back with an absolutely crazy video. Just look behind me, guys. We have a 600 brake horsepower, 1.9 TDI CI Bifa. Guys, this car is the UK's fastest. Stay tuned for this one, it's gonna be sick. Let's get it. Lewis from uh, Skiller Turbo. Yeah, here we are, man. Welcome to the channel, man. Thank you very much for inviting me. Really no, it's, a pleasure. My, it's my pleasure. Honestly, it's my pleasure. I've had a couple of your cars on before. I know. <laughs> and uh, they've done very well, actually. So basically, what I'm trying to say is you guys are serious when yeah. it comes to these cars, the PD it, engines, yeah. right? Yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah. This car is a little bit special, right? Yes, yeah. A lot of power. A lot of power. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah. we're saying 600 brake horsepower. Do you want to talk us through kind of how you've got to that number and what the split is and what you've done to the yeah, engine? Yeah, yeah. So. He's, he's a road, road car, um, I drive a daily, driving sensibly, I can do good miles per gallon, like today on the way here, I actually put a, a zero before I left home, and I've done 52 miles to the no, gallon. No, it's still yeah, doing absolutely. that. Absolutely, yeah, yeah, 52 <laughs> miles to the gallon, lovely. So to get to this power, basically, we say is the normal things you need to do. So from the block, uh, I got pistons, con, con rods, uh, con rods are Vecomer, Vecomer is a company in Portugal which rebuilds uh, engines for for racing uh block wise he's been uh um, bored okay. for two liter pistons so i got the two liter pistons is not like i said to you you could buy the zrp which is uh these are forged but they they'd be expensive say so, uh, slightly bigger okay. uh, than mine but mine is the two liter pistons um with a ported bowl where the explosion uh, the combustion chamber got you, got you. that to be honest on the block bottom bit that's what you got uh, and then going to the top, you got the head with these been uh, is um, a very common head. Okay. They do porting the head. They do a finish with the dimpling effect. Uh, bigger valves, upgraded springs, uh, camshaft uh, 272 degrees. So it's got a bit more lift. Uh, the injectors are the maximum you can get for these engines. So it's a fired 160%. Okay. Don't really need that much, even 120 would do it, but for the sake of it, I just put the 160. Okay. They, they not max though. What about turbo? What turbo? Turbo, yeah, turbo. It's your own so turbo? So turbo no? is or? our turbo. Okay. When I say ours is myself in the UK and my brother-in-law in Portugal. So the company itself, the, the, the company which makes the turbos is in Portugal. And then he sends them to me and then I sell it here. Uh, I'm the face of himself. But basically, Skiller Turbo, he, he only, basically, he gets the hands dirty and I do the easy part. Nice. It's not the easy part. But, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, uh, the Turbo is, um, is a Garrett Turbo uh, with a variable veins. He used to be from a F-Series BMW 330. Interesting. And then bigger turbine wheel, bigger compressor wheel. We convert the, the actually cartridge to ball bearing. So, we oh. CNC inside. So, it's, 
you can't buy these. He's a custom turbo. So okay. he's got a 20 instead of a 2260. He's now a 2869. Okay, interesting. A bigger VNT mechanism inside. So it's a custom turbo ready for what we need. Wow. It's a lot of power. Talking about intercooler now as well. Very important. Uh, on the diesel, the main thing is the air. If, it, if it's very hot air, forget it. You're, gonna, you're not going to get the power. So I went for um, a big intercooler, big intercooler pipes and a straight pipe, uh, exhaust pipe. But oh, yeah. intercooler pipes are uh, three inch and the intercooler is 100 mil wide and is very long. Got you. So I also got one of the shots of NOS on the inlet of the intercooler. It's very yeah. tiny, it's not to get power, it's only to refresh the air going into the intercooler. Interesting. So it's, it's got two effects, air from the outside of the, the, the car and also a very small jet just on the inlet. So air, if anybody wants to do it, it's a good, good upgrade. Oh, you're giving we away your secrets, it. We, yeah. test, no, it's, we <laughs> tested it. It's important. It, it's very important. And I, I just say to people, when you want to go for above 300 power, 300 brake horsepower, go for the biggest intercooler you can get. Dino it was a, a challenge. Um, we managed to do 420 without NOS, okay. uh, 703 newton meters torque. Wow. That's without the NOS. That's a lot. Uh, the guy of the, uh, the dyno said, look, I can't, I can't do the, with the NOS, if he's going to be more than this. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, Why is that? Wheel spin? Or? Is the, the break of the, the, break of the, the dyno, when he kicks in the, the NOS... It's too much. It's too much. Okay. He said he can damage, he's not going to give you the, the true readings, so I don't want to do it. Okay. Then um, Santa Pod opens, we race a pod a lot, so no time for, for, for checking. Got but. It. We've been doing cars for, for many years and the amount of power we, we are and the times we achieve a pod, because pod can give you a good figure of everything, um, 0 to 60 times, everything, you can see what the power is, yeah. top speed. Yeah. So 600 is a must on this car, oh, wow. Play, maybe more. And maybe what times more. are you running that pod? And then um, with, these, with this car, 10.8. Yep. Uh, wow. Uh, 134 mile an hour. That's quick. I am... 100% sure he will have to do nine seconds as he is. Wow. He will do. He will do. That he is insane. Do. Even if he's 999, I'll be happy. <laughs> that's <laughs> crazy. Do. Even to yeah. think it's a 10 second car, that, that's, it's mind blowing. 250 so, shot on Noz in the back. 250 so, so shot on Noz. Yeah. But it's a, it's a progressive. Progressive. So I got two shots. Uh, one which kicks in when the turbo reaches about two bars. I can regulate it to whatever I want. Uh, but there's no point because the engine already got a lot of power. So I let it to kick in two bars of okay. boost. And the other shot uh, comes in when I want on the, on the button. Okay. So normally what I do a pod is you let off first or, first or second gear. Once you are with both, wheel, uh, both hands on the steering, you then press the, for the last shot just to help you a little bit extra. Got you. But in total it's 250. Shot, that's yeah. a lot. Yeah, so 420 yeah. and then a 250 shot. We could be yeah. talking 670 break. Yeah, yeah. Could, could be. Yeah, <laughs> could but be. anything above 600, I like it. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Yeah, so yeah. Um, as far as putting the power down now, we must have an LSD gearbox mod. Yeah, and... LSD. Uh, LSD is a must if you want to get times a pod. I don't say use it for daily. It's, it, it, the car, it becomes a bit unstable for me, I think. The gearbox has been reinforced with, a, it's got a fourth gear, uh, support element so you machine the outside of the casting and then you put like a support uh, shaft okay. to balance to help with the impact especially fourth gear is very easy to break on this okay if you don't do it with all that sort of power it's, it's like break. you do one pull gone okay yeah. okay and then the forks are reinforced as well steel forks okay um, yeah on the gearbox so that's it yep and Lewis I'm looking uh, at that switch panel hidden away stealthily down there what is that so this is um, an add-on done by a company called LM Auto, Auto Repairs. Really nice guy. Anyway, even I wanted to keep a standard everything for NOS buttons and everything. So I asked him, can you do something for me? And he done an amazing job. Okay, so okay. got one, two, three, four, five, six switches. So our first one, I can turn my heaters to the bottles on. Okay. The second button is for the first shot, which I mentioned about on the inlet of the intercooler. Yep. The third button is for the automatic first shot of NOS. Okay. This one is for the second shot of NOS, which you can press on the steering button where the radar used to be. So yeah, I can yeah, just yeah. use wicked, it. Wicked. So nobody knows he's got a NOS shot. This one opens my bottle okay. of NOS okay. automatic. So if That's I'm sick. in a row, then somebody wants to have you a break. 
Ayo <laughs> Oh, that's yeah, cool. That's that is cool. And then this is just methanol with a little light to say the bottom is empty. Oh, yeah, man, that is, going, that's cool. That's nice, neat. Like that a, is neat. Just a, like an aeroplane control. Yes, bro. I yeah. love it. Love it. <laughs> Spot on. Good. Spot Good. on. Um, that's a very detailed breakdown of this car, but, um, you know, for a car of this kind of power, uh, a lot goes into it. So there's a lot to talk about, that's I guess, it, so, you yeah, know. Yeah, um, so, yeah, with that said, I can't wait to hit the road. Shall we, uh, shall we go for a blast? That's it. Let's go. Let's do it, bro. <laughs> CIB for the sleeper we're calling this bad boy and um, she sounds amazing Revin a lot of smoke a lot of smoke now this yeah. is always a cause for debate when um, a car smokes this much especially a diesel yeah. but we were speaking off camera and you were saying there is a difference in sometimes do you want to explain to well so basically my car is a PD 8 valves uh, it doesn't burn the fuel as good as the uh, 16 valves so okay. I know a lot of people will say oh he's smoking too much but for the power I'm using I need that I need that smoke Okay. Uh, cars like BMWs, three liters, different engines. They won't smoke as much as we as uh -huh. we have to put hours to smoke at that sort of power. Okay. You, we can't compare. But if you want reliability, he needs that amount needs of smoke. smoke. Yeah. And that's because otherwise it can melt pistons. Is yes. Yeah. The, the heat on the, on the combustion chamber it will be that high. It will melt the piston. So wow. especially when I'm using the NOS, I yep. need I need you that. Need it, I so. can I can adjust it for the daily. Yeah. But as we are, it needs full it. power. That's it. That's it. That's so there it. you go, guys. And yeah. also, who, who's your mapper? Who mapped this? Like, so I work alongside with the XTC. You will see the sticker at the back of the car. Uh -huh. uh, so he's the guy, he's from Portugal. He's the guy who works along with me. Every car I do, every car is logged. Okay. Uh, so we do loads of logs, start with base maps, and he's just a professional work. Okay. Amazing okay. work. He's a big shout out for you. Shout out to him. him. Big guy. Big guy. <laughs> wicked, he's wicked. also Louis, so he's a good mate. Okay, he's good two Louises. Two Louises, yeah. <laughs> and the guy who done the the electrics for the, yeah. the NOS is also Louis. He's Louis, three Louises, there Louis, you go, yeah. the dream team. <laughs> but yeah, give us give Being us third gear. Third gear. No NOS. No NOS. So let's go. Okay. So we're going to use the nozzle now. Yeah. And do a yeah. pull. That's cool. So, so put, open the bottle. Okay. You hear that? Oh, it's getting serious. So, you ready? Okay, I think so. Second gear. <laughs> And that's one shot. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh my god! I have never been in a diesel that moves like that. It's good. Mate, and that don't make sense. Because I've got the LSD and everything. You just it's just putting it down. We gripping. It's not raining today. Mate, we're pinned. We are pinned to the seat. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Boom! All right, here we go okay. again. Second right. gear. Okay. Oh my God! Did you hit it in fourth there? Yeah, I did. I just, a bit, it, just a bit, yeah, just a bit. Yeah, you did fell it. Keeps what? more, even yeah. more. Yeah. This car, this car for a diesel. Not, it don't even matter for any car. It don't matter what fuel we're running. This is a quick car. Cheers, man. This is Cheers, a man. Lewis has smashed it. Thank you very Bro. much. Bro. Guys, yeah. this is crazy. It's so good, man. I love this guy. I love what it. A, I really what love a tool. It. What a it's tool. Crazy, I love I, stuff I like really, this. I really would like to see the real power on a dyno. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I tuned a lot, guys, and yeah. I do think this 
he's over the hand, six hander easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It feels that way. It definitely yeah. feels that. Oh, guys, he smashed it. He smashed it. <laughs> Right guys, so it's that time, it's the Gastop Zero to 60s with the V-Box Performance Box Touch. Now today, and the heavens have just opened unfortunately, so I'm going to say this real quick. Uh, we're doing a Zero to 60, what do you reckon you're going to get? I would love to get into fives. Okay. Uh, I've, I've done a pod, okay. uh, 383. But well, that's with the proper tires, proper track. Yep, yep. But if I, I think I got power. If if it grips, yep. Maybe We're five low fives, maybe. Wow. Let's see, let's see. Uh, just to let you guys know, no one's went sub six seconds on this new V box uh, leaderboard for front wheel drive. So if you get sub six. You're okay. number one, yeah? Oh. Uh, before we do go, guys, if you do want to know a little bit more about what we're using, it's the V-Box Performance Box Touch, a wicked bit of kit. Please check the links in the description. We sell them on the OG Merch Shop. Um, it, it does everything, pretty much. Check it out. Um, ready? Yes, let's, let's go do before it. the rain. That's it, that's it. Okay. All right, guys, it is his first attempt. Noz engaged when you're ready, let's go. <laughs> Okay, no, all right. No, no. Really Loads bad. Loads of wheel spin, guys. Oh, no. His first attempt was a 6.71. I'm guessing you want to go again. Yes, yeah. <laughs> He's going again. Absolutely. <laughs> all right, guys. So is his second attempt without Noz this time, yeah? Without Noz. Okay. When you're ready, let's go. Better. Okay, but you still just went number one, no. even with the poor gear change. Guys, that was a 5.69 seconds. Can you believe it? So you're, you're number one on this on, on the leaderboard at the moment, which is great, but that gear is, it looks yeah. like you can't hit 60 in second gear. Yes. It's like you yeah. need that I need a third, third yeah. gear. I thought I didn't need it. Yeah, so now okay. we know you're going again. I go the last one then, yeah. It's going again. All right. When you're ready. <laughs> You're number one on the leaderboard, a lot of spin anyway, congratulations, I'll put the leaderboard up now, I can see that if you do get the grip on this, it is game over, uh, what a car, what a car, okay, diesel power, here we go, I'm loving, guys, I'm loving this, it's experience, I have a lot of experiences and, you know, a lot of weird and wonderful cars on the channel, but it's experiences like this, you know, things that shouldn't be moving as fast as they do to get me going. Like, yes, you know what I mean? And just it, the man. sound of this car, the feel of it, it's raw too. It it's a crazy. raw yeah, car. It's like, crazy, you know? man. It's very aggressive. Very yeah, aggressive. Very when aggressive. it's on us, really hard to control. Oh, really? Yeah. I All took right, it to the top speed and even more, Yeah. it feels really, really aggressive all, Mate, all it, the way all from the, way. the passenger seat yeah it's like wow wow it's wow yeah it's uh, wow. first time now <laughs> was it first go. time yeah oh jesus oh no okay. it's not that bad no, way it's yeah. man he's, he's manual he's dual dual mass so it's not that it's bad it's still quite yeah. yeah it's not too jumpy yeah. all right let's see if we can pull out of it okay so we're away we are away and it's actually just driving it so quite drivable so far yeah like, you know what i mean <laughs> Quite a bit of a throw on the gearbox. You were actually you saying it. your mate, you yeah. were changing gear, changing to third and punched the stereo that much. Broke but, the stereo, yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, man, it's just, it's, it's just nice, it's nice, it's nice. All right, so um, right now we are just uh, running on standard fuel, yeah. 420 brake horsepower. 120. Um, what do you say, like third gear pull is the best? Uh, I want you to feel a second. A second, a second. all right, cool. Yeah. So we'll drop it into second. Uh, hopefully it don't get too scatty. Yeah. All right, so we're waiting till we come around this corner. All right, we line up. Jesus Christ! Whoa. Yes, that is quick. It comes up on you quick, innit? You got to change gear quick. Quick, yeah. I love the popcorn limiter, though. All right, third gear. Let's get it again. Clear on. Isn't it? That's crazy. Even without knots. Without knots. How yeah. much is how quick it's moving? We completely blacked out the blacked road out, behind so us. That's it. It's like a smoke screen. It's like <laughs> Batman's car, isn't it? Like, you know what I mean? That's it, nobody can see us. <laughs> oh guys, this is a joy. This is a joy, but it's, it's still quite drivable, like Easy you know what I mean? Drive, yeah. It's not like 
You know, a, a very highly tuned car of any class is usually quite jumpy and it's yeah, well, just wants to go. Good, yeah. like, but this is, right, you daily this still, right? I do, yeah. yeah. I, I can see why. I can see why, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, this is sick. This is sick. Yes. All right, cool. Second gear now. Sorry. No, no, it's normal. It happens. Oh, guys. It's, it's the power. I've stripped and it. And we didn't even have the nose. And with no nose. How did that? Yeah, second and fourth. Can we keep moving like this or should I pull third. over? Put it in third. Put it in third. All right, guys. So it looks like we're going to end the video here. As you can see, we're still driving, so not all is lost. <laughs> we stripped fourth gear. It's crazy. As I say, at this level of power and tuning on a car like this, things happen. And unfortunately, it happened on camera. Um, and it happened today, but you know what? I had a great experience great regardless. Awesome. Lewis, you're the man. You're Thank the man. You, man. Everyone Thank involved you. in this build, like, this is this is crazy. This is crazy. Bro, bro, this, is, this is crazy. Good to hear. Um, even pulling, you know, at, like, let's say normal fuel at 420 brake, absolutely epic. Um, it's been you wanna, a crazy you day. wanna just try one time in third gear, the nose? <laughs> you haven't tried You wanna it. do it again? Yeah? Just, just don't put forth, just okay. lay off. I yeah. just pull in third, yeah? Put, <laughs> this guy's put, crazy. Put the foot down. Alright, now? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> I like Lewis! <laughs> Lewis is the man who's broken and he's still saying do boost it! Again, it. Do it again. Oh, you say doing it again! <laughs> yes, Lewis! Hey, okay, shout out whoever you want to shout out, please, right now. Alright, big shout out to my brother in law, Skiller Turbo Guy, uh, Elder Puto for all the mechanical work he done on my car, XTC for the excellent map on this. He's a best guy out there. <laughs> uh, Vaycomer for all the parts, race parts, big shout. LM uh, Autosport for all the, the kit for the the nitros and the heater bottles. And that's it my guys. Thank you very much. Epic. No, thank you again bro. Thank you, thank you again. Thank, thank you. you so much. Guys if you have enjoyed today please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'll leave links to everyone he shouted out in the description so you can find, find them and um, definitely your Instagram so people can catch up with you too. Yes, and you, um, yeah we'll catch you on the next one. Peace yeah, out. Man. Nice yeah, one, man. brother. Yeah, <laughs>